We spent late November 2023 through mid-January 2024 in Colombia, and here are our top seven experiences. Monserrate was a sacred mountain to the ancient Muisca people, and Spanish Catholics claimed it in the 17th century, building a church at the peak. Today, it's the most prominent and popular landmark in Bogota. You can ride a funicular or cable car, or hike the 2,000-foot climb to the top. The Barranquilla Carnival has been called the world's second largest after Rio de Janeiro. The Barranquilla Carnival Museum gives a wonderful tour of the history and culture of the carnival. <music> Colombia's indigenous Muisca people produce gold for millennia, and stories of El Dorado, a legendary kingdom of gold, are what drew the Spanish here in the first place. The Gold Museum has an incredible collection and does a fantastic job of showing why gold was and is so important here. Cartagena on the Caribbean coast has some of the best sunsets we've ever seen. Whether it's from the west-facing old city walls, or from the top of San Felipe de Barajas Fort, or on a cruise from the old city port, the ones we saw here were nothing short of spectacular. From the build-up in Bogota, to the town parade in Salento, to Cartagena's historic city walls, building up to Christmas Eve in Barranquilla, spending Christmas in Colombia was extra special. We love good coffee, and growing up in the U.S., Juan Valdez and Colombian coffee were legendary. So taking a tour of a Colombian coffee farm was an incredible experience. The beautiful Corcora Valley is a UNESCO heritage site and the backdrop for Disney's Encanto. Touring the valley on foot or horseback was unforgettable and our number one Colombian experience. Mm -hmm. 